Did you just buy a new monitor and you're looking to get the most out of your refresh rate? Or maybe someone gave you some old monitors and they told you, oh yeah, it's 75 hertz or oh yeah, it's 120 hertz. Here's how you can not only check your monitor's refresh rate, but also set it to the highest refresh rate possible. Howdy, my name is Timmy, here with Sirius Power PC. And before we get into this video, if you wouldn't mind leaving a like so that you get more tutorials like this in your algorithm, as well as subscribing with the notification bell on, that way you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. We're almost to 40,000 subscribers. In fact, by the time you see this, we might be at 40,000 subscribers. So thank you all so, so much for subscribing. And if you haven't subscribed yet, maybe give it a little bit of thought. Also, check out our affiliate program because you might be able to win a free PC if you're able to promote your link enough. Now let's get straight to the tutorial. So I just finished the setup. As you can see here, I have my one monitor, which is still in the horizontal uh, aspect ratio on the computer, but it needs to be vertical. And I have my main monitor here, and I have my side monitor off to the side over here. So the first thing you wanna go is go to your display settings. So on your desktop, click anywhere right click and then click right here on display settings once you get there as you can see it has one two and three if you click identify that will put a number on each monitor over here is monitor three so what we want to do to essentially change the refresh rate this monitor right here is 240 hertz this monitor over here is 75 hertz and this monitor is just a 60 hertz monitor so this is monitor number one what we're going to do is we're going to scroll down here and we're going to click on advanced display settings when we do that we have a drop down menu right here that lets you pick any of your monitors i'm a slight scepter fan what we're going to do is we're going to select our k25 monitor which is this curved central monitor right here and we'll come down here to refresh rate now we're going to come right here and we're going to select the highest possible refresh rate which is 240 hertz so go ahead and click on that your monitor will go blank for just a second however when you change it back you will see that it is now way way smoother go ahead and click keep changes that way it doesn't revert them and i mean look at how buttery smooth. It's kind of hard to see on video. Here's a 240 hertz comparison to 120 hertz to 60 hertz. It's a big difference. Now that we have the highest refresh rate selected for that, we will come here to the drop down again, and we will select our F24, which is this side monitor right here. And we're going to change that refresh rate up to the 75 hertz. And as you can see, this monitor went off. It should now be a bit smoother. However, I'm also gonna show you how to get that vertical uh, orientation set on that. We're gonna click keep changes. And then you can check it, but I'm just gonna quickly check this monitor. Oh, this E20 monitor actually does go up to 75 hertz. That's pretty cool. We'll select that. That monitor will go dark there and then come back on. I actually didn't know that monitor was 75 hertz, so it might help to go ahead and check all three of these. So to make this display over here a vertical display, what we're gonna do is we're going to come back to settings. We're gonna make sure that's selected. So now you scroll down here to where it says display orientation. You select that drop down, and you select portrait. Now, if you keep changes and look over here, it's now set to a portrait mode display. You can also select it to be a portrait of flipped where it'll basically put that up at the top, or obviously, you know, if your monitor is upside down, then you can fix that. But you want the taskbar to be on the bottom. You can change the taskbar. I'll make a video showing how to do that soon. But yeah, that is how you change the orientation of your monitor. And then you will probably have to adjust this. Like for example, I have that monitor connects right about in the middle. So like, for example, I'll drag that up slightly. You'll hit apply then I should be able to come over here and my mouse be pretty close. So tweak with that, obviously, and like over here, the mouse also appears at about the same place it goes off. So you'll have to tweak with that, but that is basically how you change your monitor refresh rate. Anyways, guys, I hope that tutorial was able to help you. If you wouldn't mind leaving a like if it did help you and commenting down below another tutorial you might want to see us do, maybe how to add a hard drive or how to add multiple monitors, how to change monitors, stuff like that. 
then go ahead and leave a comment about that in the description or in the comment section down below. Subscribe if you're new because we put out a video every week on Saturday and be sure to check out our affiliate program at the link in the description down below. And if you ever need anything, whether it be a new PC or some new peripherals for your PC, be sure to give us a visit over at SeriousPowerPC.com. My name is Timmy here with Serious Power PC. Thank you so, so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next week for a brand new video.